Hey everyone, JL here with just a quick video. So uh, I know things have been crazy as of late. The election cycle's got everybody on pins and needles. Um, it's been full of surprise and intrigue. You know, all things that Americans love. Uh, but uh, given the recent events, uh, especially the events of last night, um, I felt I'd, I just wanted to pop on and say, even though this isn't uh, intended to be a political channel, and it's not going to be a political channel, but uh, I wanted to say, you know, the past few years, you know, the storm that we have weathered has been, um, has been difficult, uh, at, you know, many times. You know, I honestly, I could go on and on, but, um, but we have weathered it. And uh, while for a while there, I was, I was starting to get really concerned, I, was, I had a real worry that the fundamental, the fundamental uh, kind of bedrock of this nation had shifted, that, uh, that hate, that ignorance, that fear, uh, conspiracy, and uh, divisive rhetoric had replaced what I, you know, had come to know and come to accept as, as the foundation of this nation. Um, and it's just, for me, it's just gotten worse. Every single day, it got worse and worse and worse. But, uh, and, you know, this election cycle has just been crazy, so... And then all of a sudden last night, I, I saw that I was wrong. That the foundation of this nation has not changed. It's just been buried under a mountain of ignorance and intolerance and juvenile asinine behavior and just ridiculous crap. Um, the foundation of this nation, of equality, of justice, of rule of law, of respecting that your rights end at the end of your hand, that we can share this space with each other, that we can progress towards a future together. These things still exist. We may have forgotten it. Many people may have not been able to see it. And when you're blind for so long and you just get beaten every day uh, with every tweet, it's, it's hard to see a light at the end of the tunnel, but last night showed that there is a light at the end of the tunnel. That we can weather this storm. We have weathered this storm. We will get past this. We will see the change we want in this nation. We will be able to come together again as a people to work towards a brighter future, progressing in all the areas that we need to progress. And we can bring everybody along with us. And no one will be left out in the cold. That divisiveness, that ignorance, that fear, and just generally being an asshole. We can put those away. We can put them back where they belong in the past with the individual who stirred that up in this nation. For the first time, I'm hopeful for the future of this nation. Um, now, the, the, the results are not in. You know, this is a coin toss, but I'm glad to see that I was wrong, that this nation does still have a foundation that I believe was intended by our forefathers, that progression and the future and working together equality are still, are still the things that drive us. And, uh, for, you know, for the first time in four years, I'm, I'm really, really hopeful. So whether or not, win or lose, I know that that still stands. That that is still where we come from. That's where we speak from. And, uh, you know, like I said, win or lose, we're going to get back there again. And, uh, you know, it may take four years. It may take four days. We don't know. But... Um, this is not going to be a political channel. I don't intend to comment on politics, but uh, I found myself really, really happy this morning, and I kind of wanted to share it with you guys. Um, you know, it was a it was a good morning. So uh, I hope uh, today finds you great. Um, as always, uh, be safe and be excellent to each other, and we will see you next time.